What's up, everybody? Welcome back to another episode of Fab Town. Pretty cool. Chappie went ahead and filmed some stuff for me while I'm away. Um, he ended up buying a Mark IV Supra. It's a NA 2J with a auto, um, but it is a right-hand drive one that he had uh, purchased from an importer. It's pretty sweet. I'm looking forward to doing some more videos on it. Um, obviously, he wasn't going to wait for me to get back <laughs> to start modifying it, so he went ahead and uh, did a quick exhaust modification. He is kind of trying to keep this thing really clean and really stock because it is like a pretty low mileage um, car and everything is like very untouched. So I don't think we're going to be doing anything super crazy to it, but like I said, he did a quick exhaust modification and he went ahead and sent me the videos that he shot. Um, the quality probably isn't the best because we had to send it like five different ways because they're bigger files. Um, so I hope you guys enjoy and I'll commentate along the way. Hey guys, I was supposed to be shooting videos and oopsie daisy. So what I'm doing is <clears throat> getting ready to put this muffler on my new car. I got a Supra, it's over there. But what I did so far is since this is a four in, four out muffler, I put a tip on it and I'm welding up this uh, cone reducer on there so I can get it down to the smaller bit of pipe because I'm not trying to do the whole exhaust because it's not worth it and what I'm working with now is this weird fucking half smashed tip crappily done but what they did was take the muffler off and just uh, straight piped it from the muffler so what I'm going to do is probably block off that resonator and still use that one and then reduce it down to this pipe because I do not like loud cars anymore. Unless it's my race car. This is not my race car so I'd rather not get pulled over as much as I can. So, surprise surprise, I bought a Supra, some might know. Others probably don't, but I guess I will record when I'm done doing other shit. Alright, there it is, all welded up, looks super shitty. That's because I never sharpened or cleaned the tungsten after I've dipped it 500 times. But, no one's going to see that part, so tough titties. Alright guys, so this is pretty much where it's going to be. Uh, I did the reducer. It goes to like two inch piping or some shit, so I have hella gaps to fill with the MIG, but I am no stranger to doing that. And that'll pretty much uh, wrap it up, because I got fucking drag slicks to sell, and I gotta drive this bitch to Boise, so hopefully it doesn't drone like crazy. There it is, guys. That's how she sits. Uh, I'm not going to show you the details because I'm sure you can imagine what bird shit looks like. Uh, as you can hear, it's uh, pretty quiet. I'll see if I can't set the phone up to get some rest. As you guys can see, he got his exhaust all welded up. Uh, you know, I, I can't really knock him for leaving that giant gap at the end. I mean, and the way that the resonator is set up, like I said, he wanted it pretty quiet. And the gap at the end is more just a fabrication aesthetics thing, um, especially at that point when you've reduced it down. It's not going to be like a big power reduction that it doesn't meet perfectly. So. I'm really stoked that he went ahead and did all that. Uh, you know, I didn't, I didn't uh, know if he was going to be able to take some time and shoot a quick video, so I'm really thankful for that. And uh, you know, I'm looking forward to do some other small videos while I'm here, since I only have a little bit of time left. Um, I'm looking at probably doing a 
what it's like to be in the Air Force for 10 years video, because I'm actually coming up on 10 years in the Air Force, and also what it's like to deploy it as an aircraft maintainer. Um, so if you guys want to see those videos or you think you'd be interested, um, go ahead and pop a comment in the, in the you know, below this video. Um, I'm kind of back and forth on whether I want to do it just because it doesn't really pertain to my channel. Um, but if you guys would like to see that, you know, go ahead and put it in the uh, comments below. That's going to be it for today, guys. Oh, as always, thanks for watching. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Um, and uh, looking forward to doing more content. See you guys next time.